in a workout right now. I have a 10 o'clock appointment, a nail appointment. Um, but I'm getting ready to do a HIIT workout. I'm gonna stretch first. And then the focus of today is just to lift. So yeah, you guys will see a little bit of that. finishing the gym I forgot to film guys I got it into my workout and I forgot to film the rest of it but I'll tell you guys what I what I did so after you guys yeah you guys saw the treadmill that was the last clip so I did a hit session I did five minutes on the Stairmaster and then I did 10, 10 minutes on the treadmill and basically I did um, you know how you do hit on a treadmill is say you will walk for one minute and then you sprint for 30 seconds so i did that on and off and you do that for you know 10 minutes so and i found the workout let me go to the windows up because y'all can't hear me i found the workout on pinterest like you know if you struggle with like coming up with workouts there's tons and tons of them on pinterest so i just found um a hit treadmill one and that's what i followed um, and then after that, I did a weight training session. So I did squats. Um, I did, I think I did three sets of squats. I did a variation of the hip thrust. I did dead, three sets of deadlifts. I did good mornings. I did um, uh, kickbacks, leg kickbacks, um, which works the glutes. And then, I mean, I did a whole body workout because the jogging and the sprinting that I did and I also did incline on the treadmill as well so it was a series of movements that works your core so the last time i did a hit workout on the treadmill which is like i think the week before last yeah last week actually yeah um the next day my abs were killing me and i really had no idea because i had never had that feeling after working out after working out on the treadmill i had never experienced that i already kind of feel sore in my core area and of course squats is a compound movement things the certain movements that you do that are compound movements that works your whole your core as well so that's good um, because i want to strengthen my core so that's pretty much all that i did with the workout and then i finished off in the sauna so i did 14 minutes in the sauna i'm on my way home now to change and then i'm going to get my nails done I already put coffee in there, like a cup of coffee. This is the brand. I talked about this in the previous video. A banana, ice, and I just poured in this milk. It has, it's almond milk with cashew. And it's, it's dairy free, it's plant based. I'm also gonna put a little bit of pumpkin creamer by the same company that makes the coffee dairy free just a little bit just so it can have a little bit of flavor and then this does have um it only has two sugars well it has four sugars because that's two two grams of sugar and then two grams of added sugar so this is where the sugar is going to go into for the for the smoothies like i don't need to add honey or anything like that i'm also going to add some of this chocolate um chocolate milk by the brand ripple also dairy free so most of the milks that i'm using they're all dairy free um also this has some extra protein eight grams so i'm just gonna do a splash this does have sugar but i just i just like one fourth not even a cup um because it does have 17 it's 17 grams of um, carbs and it has 15 grams of sugar in it so i'm gonna be easy on that i'm adding chocolate protein powder by um what is this who's this by oh garden of life it does taste a little bit like dirt but 
It does have cho <laughs> chocolatey flavor and that's why we added the chocolate milk, but it's organic plant-based protein. I'm making one for Lawrence, so I'm making, I'm gonna put two scoops in here. Two big heavy scoops. And then lastly, I'm gonna put in this collagen and it's salted caramel, so all the flavors are just gonna blend together very nicely. And that's just one scoop of that, and that is by the brand Perfect Keto. So, I'm just gonna blend, oh, almost forgot. I'm also putting in cacao powder, organic cacao powder. If you don't know about cacao powder, Google it, it's very good for you. It has protein, antioxidants, dietary fiber, and minerals, but very, very, very good for your body. I'm gonna put um, a tablespoon, a couple tablespoons of this in here. Oh, well, that's a heaping. When they say a heaping tablespoon, that's what they mean, okay? It's okay. And I am going to also put some water in here too. I don't want the smoothie to be too thick. Put some water in here. And then blend this puppy. first house I like I like um houses to redo what do you call it older houses this house is 345 and I know it's the location but I would not buy this house the, be the bedroom is the bedroom is small look at this huge palmetto bug they really need to come and clean up I like this room but I like it mostly because of the window yeah, this is what We'd have to knock down walls and open yeah. this completely up. And look, see, it's already got settling, it's already cracked. They tried to uh, patch up. Put it in there. Y'all like it? This house is older than our house. Second house. It's three bedrooms, which is what we have now. Do you like that? It's brown. Is it three floors? Yeah. I know you like that. My daughter likes it's got stairs. Three floors, feet. Okay. Kitchen is nice. Got a bathroom off the kitchen. Which I don't know how sanitary that is. What's that? Having a bathroom in the kitchen. Oh, that's great. Oh, it's got a balcony. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Look, this is nice. Yeah, this is nice. This is nice. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, very nice. This is a All the family left me. I don't know if this is a faux wall or not, but okay, so now we're going upstairs. Shower. Bring a floor. Don't look safe. How many rooms? So is it? This is. Also, oh, the, the is the room on the bottom. The for the one of the bedrooms then. Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay, so I don't understand that. Shower small. You don't really get too much bang for your buck here. So it's not a true three bedroom, is it? It's a two bedroom. Two bedroom. With a shower. So that it's called it a bedroom because it has a bathroom. And which has a shower in it. The kids must not like this house. Y'all yes. left. Do you like this house? This kitchen is bigger than our kitchen. statement. Oh. I mean, do you think that it would get destroyed? I mean, we obviously would get the gray. We wouldn't get white. Do you like this better than the other ones? I mean, I don't like the. I don't like that it's low. And I don't like the price. Yeah, All right. <laughs> 